good day everyone in this video we are going to learn the calculation of hydrostatic draft we are going to discuss problems 7 and 8 from MB Hinship MB Hinship problem number 7 she is floating at a draft of 5.65 meters forward and 7.45 meters aft you have to calculate her hydrostatic draft and her displacement. The mean draft of 5.65 and 7.45 meters is 6.55 meters. The trim is 1.8 meters by the stern. Against the draft of 6.55 meters, we have to find her LCF from hydrostatic tables. 6.55 meters and her hydrostatic and her LCF is between 72.176 and 72.005 meters. After interpolation we find her LCF to be equal to 72.048 meters and it is always forward of the up perpendicular. The formula to calculate the correction to the draft is LCF upon LBP into trim. LCF is 72.048, LBP is 143.16, trim is 1.8 and we get her correction to be 0.906 meters. Now remember one thing, since we have taken the LCF from the arc perpendicular, the correction has to be applied to the after draft and not to the mean draft. So, hydrostatic draft therefore will be 7 after draft plus minus correction to the after draft. Now, we have to decide on the sign for this correction. As I have taught you in class, since the trim is by the stern, the sign will be positive and LCF being always forward of the arc perpendicular, the sign will be negative. So algebraically speaking, we have a positive and a negative, so the result will be negative. So we apply a negative sign to this correction. Hence, hydrostatic draft works out to 7.450 meters minus 0 0.906 meters, which gives you 6.544 meters. Against this draft, we have to find her displacement. Go to the hydrostatic tables and again 6.544 meters, which lies between 6.4 and 6.6 .6 meters, and the displacements of 12,927 and 13,383 metric tons. After interpolating, we find the hydrostatic draft. And that at hydrostatic draft 6.544 meters, the displacement is 13,255.3 metric tons. Now we go to problem number 8. Inship is floating at a forward draft of 7.40 meters, aft draft of 6.60 meters in, water, in dock water of relative density 1.06. 1.016, sorry. Here we have to calculate her hydrostatic draft, her displacement and her dead weight. Original drafts, initial drafts, forward 7.4, aft 6.6. The mean of the two is 7 meters. And the trim here is 0 0.8 meters by the head, since the forward draft is more than the after draft. Against the mean draft of 7 meters, we go to hydrostatic tables to find her LCF. 7 meters LCF is 71.606 metric tons. Uh, meters, sorry, 71.606 meters. So, LCF for a mean draft of 7 meters is 71.606 meters. Correction. Is given by the is calculated by the formula LCF upon LBP multiplied by the trim. 
which gives you an answer of 0 0.40 meters. Now what sign will you apply? Since the trim is by the head, it is negative sign and LCF is always forward of half perpendicular, hence that is also negative sign. The two negatives make a positive, hence this correction will have a positive sign. So this has to be added to the after draft. Please do not ever make the mistake of adding these corrections to the mean draft. So 6.6 .6 plus 0.4 gives you a hydrostatic draft of 7 meters. Against this draft of 7 meters, we have to find her displacement in water of relative density 1.016. If you remember your problem number 2 of MV Hinship, let us go to 7 meters in salt water. All ta this table is calculated for salt water, is 14,299 metric tons. This has to be converted for displacement in dock water. To do that, you divide by 1.025 and multiply by 1.016 and you get a displacement at 7 meters hydrostatic draft in relative density 1.016 to be 14173.4 metric tons. Now, we have to find her dead weight. To find her dead weight, you have to know her light displacement. Her light displacement is found from this page on the hydrostatic tables. Here you see it's 5,500 metric tons is her light chip weight. So displacement is 14,173.4 metric tons and her light chip is 5,500. Okay, she is using 5,499.8 metric tons. You subtract this from your displacement and you will get her dead weight which is equal to 8,673.6 metric tons. Thank you guys for your attention. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up, share it and subscribe to my channel please. Have a good day. Goodbye.